Okay, I'm up here with uh, Kenny Reed, and I'm getting my first nuke. Say hi to YouTube, Kenny. Hey, YouTube. All right. So uh, I've got three frames in there right now, and Kenny's going to put five in. Hopefully and, with the uh, bees and brood. And, and a queen. And a, maybe a queen. Maybe a queen. <laughs> and that's the reason why I went with the nuke. Uh, well, I went with reeds because everybody says they're the best, but I went with a nuke because the hive is already growing and active. And you can see in here, well, actually that's a, that's a pretty nice looking one there. And we're going to look for the queen so we can mark her while we're going through it. So they've got the eggs laid, is that eggs in the yeah, middle? That's cat brood mainly with a little larvae and eggs on the outer side. And they've got some honey out here. Uh-huh, quite a bit of honey on the outer. Yeah. So you can see all the girls in there working the the the, the uh, mm -hmm. super there. So this is a an eight frame box. That one doesn't. Have There's a queen on this frame. Where do you see? She's right here. Uh, you gonna mark her? Yep. See her? Yeah, I see her. There she is. I don't know if you guys can see her. She's the one, the kind of the long, skinny one. Has a pointy. 20 uh, abdomen. She's the only one that can get her abdomen all the way down to the bottom of the, there she is, bottom of the cell. Yeah. And he's going to put this year's color on her. No, the, uh, I'm not sure this is oh. not this year's. Okay. This is just a color that a stands color. out. That works. Because I'm colorblind anyway, so if it's bright, I'll see it. So. Yeah, bright. Just something different. Yep. Excellent. Okay. Now you can she see her better. Far. There she goes. All right, that, that's very good. Now I've got, uh, these are a wooden frame with black plastic. Uh, Kenny says they, the bees like that better. So uh, we're hoping that's the case. There we go. There are about, about 3,000 bees in a nuke. Is that, is there, that about right? Yeah, maybe, maybe a few more, but, but roughly. And that's mainly a pollen and honey frame. Oh yeah, see how wet that is? I don't know if you guys can see that, but this is all wet in here with all that honey. Yeah. And that's only honey on this side. Mm-hmm. Okay, so honey is good, but we're looking for brood. Or not brood, but yeah. Well, actually, Look, you, got, you got three big frames of brood. Now okay. a frame or so of honey on either side is what we're needing to, which and, is that's what that is. Excellent. Now it's going to keep them fed. And then I'm going to put sugar water on top as soon as I get them home. Excellent. Good job, Kenny. Okay. So we put the, uh, the, the nuke in the center, and then they start working from the center out and filling it up. Now, I've got the front door closed, but you can open it if you want. Or you I'll just uh, bounce them in the top. Dump them in. So he's just knocking the bees down, and he's just going to pour them in there just like water. And they'll work their way down. Uh, into the hive. You can probably hear them. Okay, and then I'm just gonna put the tape back on and hold it on. Uh, today I'm in full covering. I'm not gonna take any chances. We just got uh, done with the mean hive. Kenny was doing good all day and then uh, some girls got after them. They so, did it especially for YouTube. Did they? Okay. Yeah. It's official. Ken, Ken gets done. We may move to another one. We're going to look at this one and see if it's uh, up to strength. It's From the top it looks a little weaker than the other ones, but we're going to double check it. And this is one advantage with working with a local bee uh, professional is that they are interested in taking good care of the customers. It's actually better than it looks. Okay. Uh, um, and so they'll they'll hand pick. I've seen him put some aside earlier today that he didn't feel that were 100 percent. So you see, these are actually laid all the way up. Instead of having honey on the outer wall, this one actually has brood on the outer wall. Okay. Uh, a little little bit of honey on the outside, but not much. Now put them over here. So it's better, like I said, than it looked. No, it's okay. I got it. Thanks. Yeah. Here she is on this frame. Okay. Can you? Can you, can you spot her? Let's see if I can see her. There she is right here. There. 
There she is. Oh yeah, she's quite a bit larger, and she's got the long, narrow abdomen. I feel good. Feel real good. Are you getting stung, Walter? Oh, Walter's stinging. He's not getting. Today nothing. Nothing happened today. Okay. So we got a dot on her head, so you can see her better. All right. So if when I open up the hide, work on him, I'll be able to see her. Not that I'll be looking for her. I only look for her if there's. I think there's a problem. Other than that, if there's eggs, there's fresh um, eggs in there, I'll just let her, I'll, I'll just know that she's in there. I'm going to see the other. We got the cart before the horse, didn't we? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, not everybody here wears full outfits, okay? There's some braver souls here. <laughs> uh, <better> stupid. <laughs> I did that, and I learned uh, I'm more comfortable at this point in my beekeeping with a full suit on. Up until about an hour ago, you know, before it got later in the afternoon, it was a lot more pleasant to work even without. They didn't uh, jump on us, but now that it's getting closer to dark, they're a little more aggressive. That one's not got much on it. Nah, I'm going to get another three. Okay. So we got one ready. I'm going to go get another frame from another nuke. Nuke is short for nucleus, so it's the nucleus of a new hive, is what we're after. Now, uh, the reeds have 1,600 hives out here. That's really incredible. He started with two hives, and here he is, now full-time professional beekeeper. 1,600 hives and helping us new guys out. Awesome. Thanks a lot, Kenny. You're welcome. This is a LDS prepper out. <laughs>